Assalamualaikum. First, I would like to introduce myself. I am Nur Atika from KBA 2493B. COVID-19 has turned our lifestyle into something different than previously. Perhaps all the students have the shift towards the new norm of coping with online class that has to be made uh, through various platforms such as Google Meet, WebEx and several platforms. Due to these changes, I am a student that faces few challenges and difficulties. I believe it is not easy to go through where sitting in front of laptop, coping few hours, struggling along in order to complete studying assignments, online class, and even answering questions online. Planning a proper strategy to overcome and reduce the burden of online classes is there a need for all students to switch into more effective way of coping each with this issue? It is compulsory needed. Whereas for me, as a student, I have been going through several episodes of sleepless night, having plenty of time to sleep, and for sure making me into someone who have become rushing and unorganized while managing on my task. Hence, I have to come out and view on the most common important strategies that every student out there should implement in their life. The strategies that I myself apply into my learning lifestyles are managing time effectively. Managing time effectively. Time has been one of the most students choosing over. Yes, I believe improper time management have made students to do their tasks last minute, um, to overlap their tasks and with, a, with another task to make them focus for a longer period of time. It is actually not easy as I have been going through this phase as well. Why am I saying that good time management help the most we can do a task calendar. Why am I saying a calendar instead of writing tasks in notebooks? Jotting down our tasks on books does not work well. As calendar, which allow us to map out uh, the specific date we should submit our tasks, or easier to say that the deadlines. We will be aware on the date and surely we will make a starting plan one by one on what to complete and how to complete it. Next, it would be instead of reading, revising studies on slide in using your phone or, or laptop, printing out all those notes will make us to become more organized. So when the teachers or lectures are teaching, we can easily pick up on the, uh, on the slides and start to write out the keywords that will actually help us later on. The most important habits that we should change are doing last minute or studying at last minute. Perhaps I know as many of us love to this love to do this, right? Good time management uh, bring us towards less strife, less stress life. Uh, could avoid us from being rushing while doing all those tasks. As well as it is important for us to be wise enough, wise enough to plan over our daily time. So, to conclude at to be a smart student, time, time is the most valuable, valuable asset that we have. Managing time, as how I mentioned previously, helped me so much as a student. All the students, please do start planning out what are the best ways to organize your time. I know starting out right today is impossible. Make some little changes that will attach us towards these good habits. For example, look at ourselves. After doing all those strategies that I mentioned, what changes that we will actually uh, love it later on. Remember, time are uh, what we want the most, but we use it the worst. That's all. Uh, a little wrap up, wrap up for our topic today. Enjoy your phase of online learning with better strategies. Thank you.